Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today we are going to do convert sorted array to binary search tree. Let's understand the question first, then we'll move to the approach. Given an integer array nums, where the elements are sorted in ascending order. Convert it to a height balanced binary search tree. A height balanced binary search tree is a binary search tree in which the depth of the two subtrees of every node never differs by more than one. Okay, so we have been given an array, a sorted array, and we have to convert a height balanced binary search tree. This is the question. So let's understand it, how we can approach this question. So as we have been told that we have to create a height balanced binary search tree. Okay, so the first thing that comes in our mind is if the array is sorted, if the array is sorted, then we can have the middle element as our root node. Okay, so let's try to create the binary tree for binary search tree first and then we'll see how we can do it programmatically. So if I take zero as my root element, I'll have five and nine to be on the right side or right on the right subtree and this two elements minus three and minus 10 will be on my left because they are smaller than zero and five and nine are greater than zero. Okay, now let's again create one more node. So what we will do, we'll take middle of these two elements. There is no middle, so we can take either three or we can take either 10. So let's take three over here. Now we know that minus 10 is also smaller than, so we'll create another node and it will go to the left. Here also we'll do the same thing because there are two elements and there is no middle element. So either we can take this or this. So we'll take five and then we will take nine. So this is how, this is the one binary tree that is possible. The another one can be like, we can have minus 10 over here and then we can have three over here. Similarly, we can have nine over here and we can have five over here. Like this one more tree can, like there are multiple options that we can create. So we just have to return the one possible binary search tree which is height balanced okay so how we can approach this question the simple the simple approach will be that we take the middle element of the array and we create the root node and recursive like and we call the recursive method to create the left subtree and to create the right subtree so what i will do i will get the middle element okay middle element and I'll create like for example my middle index is 0 1 2 okay so my middle element will be index will be 2 this will be index and it will be 2 what I will do I'll create new BST with norms index 2 okay then I will what I will do for this is BST, okay, suppose. Now this is BST dot left. I will call the same method recursively. And for right subtree also, I will call the same method. Now how will I identify? So for that we will pass the range, the start index and the end index of that array. So let's try to understand this on the coding screen. So we are on our coding screen now. First, the first basic condition uh, we can have is that if nums dot length double equal to zero we will return null okay now what are we going to do is we'll create our helper method okay so we'll we'll create a method with return get bst okay we will pass the array we will pass the starting index of the array so currently our starting index is zero and we will pass the ending index the end index of the array which will be nums.length minus one 
okay now let's create our helper method so this will be public public int sorry the return type will be tree node public tree node get bst we will accept integer array one will be my start index another will be my end index okay now what we will do the, uh, here the base condition for to like to stop the recursive call the base condition will be if start index is greater than end index we will return null okay now what we will do we will create our bst so we'll do tree node bst is equals to new tree node and we will pass the value okay let's pass the value and the value will be nums of start index okay now we need the middle index also okay yeah because start index will not be my root node correct our root node will be the middle index so let's find out the middle index first middle index is equals to start index plus end index divided by 2 we will get the middle index and we will create our root node with the help of this middle index okay now what we will do we will do bst dot left is equals to get bst this is a recursive call and we will pass nums now what will be my start index for the left subtree of so left subtree for left subtree the start index will remain start index only but the end index will be middle index minus 1 correct similarly for bst dot right get bst our recursive call nums our array now start index will be middle index plus 1 and the end index will be end index correct at the end we will return bst okay let's try to run this code we have some error yes so this is start index and end index what is happening return null okay let's again try to run this yeah this is working we don't have any compile time errors yeah this works so if you like the video like the video and share with your friends and also don't forget to subscribe the channel Thank you so much for watching the video. Bye.